today's read, read aloud is Pirates Go to School. I'm pretty sure we read this on the very first week of school. It's one of my favorites because it's kind of funny. Let's read it again today. Pirates Go to School. What's this pirate eating? A little squid? Huh. And look at his parents eating a cracker. I love squid. Have you ever had calamari at a restaurant? It's fried squid. It's so yummy. I like to dip it in red like spaghetti sauce. You should try it if you ever get the chance. It's delicious. It tastes so good. Pirates come to school each day with backpacks full of books. They hang their pirate swords up on the coat rack on the hooks. Are we allowed to bring swords to school? No. Pirates bring their parrots who echo what they say. Good morning, teacher. Good morning, teacher, is how they start each day. To sit next to a pirate is everybody's wish, but better hold your nose because they smell like rotting fish. Oof, pee you. Pirates learn their letters. X marks the spot. Y, Z. Pirates learn arithmetic. Two skulls plus one equals three. Arithmetic is a fancy word for math. Pirates like to paint black skies, make cannonballs with clay. Pirates bring home artwork to their pirate ship each day. Mrs. Um, Storley has us make clay sculptures, right? We made little tiny birds. Pirates share at show and tell the stuff they bring is old. A treasure chest, a treasure map, a piece of pirate gold. You're a real pirate today because you're going to make a treasure map, right? And a treasure chest. Pirates won't eat peanut butter. They won't touch cheese or carrots. At snack time, they want slimy squid and crackers for their parrots. Pirates nap at nap time, since that's what nap time's for. The only trouble is, pirates always snore. Can you make a snoring noise? Can you do it? Louder, I can't hear you. Good job. Pirates play at walk the plank and other games quite daring, but then the teacher calls time out because she hears them swearing. Uh-oh, are, are you allowed to use bad words? No. We hate timeouts, Our We hate timeouts, Our Pirates and parrots roar. Behave yourself, the teacher warns, or you'll sit five minutes more. Let's mutiny, let's mutiny, pirates and parrots cry. But wait, it's almost story time, so pirates do not try. At story time, the pirates beg for tales of ships at sea, and at the end, they spin some yarns of pirate treachery. All of their scary pirate stories. When the school day's over, pirates put everything away. They clean the mess their parrots made, and this is what they say. Yo ho ho, we're so cool. We are pirates and we love school. Are they running to get on their bus? Uh-oh, I think Mr. Paulson and Mrs. Lang would tell them to slow down, right? If they were on bus duty. Now they're back again for the next day. I hope you enjoyed this book. See you later.